Hello, welcome back to Primal. You can see this, these things. I have to be very careful here. And if you, in case you forgot the last part, Jen's been captured again. Whoops. Sorry about that, Scree. Just wants to give me all these lodestones. So something in this room like that. That looks like a climbable wall right there, so we'll see if we can get up there. actually go somewhere though. Well it goes up here. There we go. Right, can we... No, apparently we can't. I'm not sure why, if I can interface with it, I can... Hmm. Really certain where I'm supposed to go then. Unless it's here, but all ah, right, I wasn't close enough. Yeah, it would be helpful if I could just climb down, but no, I've got to go all the way around again.
Um, I must be able to do something here. to tell if that's actually a place to climb or just a graphical glitch up there. Yeah, it looks like a somewhere I could climb into. No, it isn't. Okay. Get up there, I somehow doubt it. sure where I'm supposed to be going but no change there is there uh Okay, is there any particular reason I can't stand on that ledge? Okay, this is really confusing. I'm, I can't go down, I can't go up. Seriously, I'm not seeing anywhere to go.
can't get in any of these windows. Ah, what's that? Maybe I can climb onto there and get across that pipe. Maybe. Ah. Oh. Okay, looks like this might be the way to go. Very elaborately designed chamber, really. Hmm. Oh, lever over here. Let's see what this does. Well, that opens that. Good. Progress. Go through the pipes this time. Be your little vandal. going on here. Oh, hello. Only the innocent, the brave, and the lunatic would dare to rouse Queen Malakel from her rest. 
Which have I here? Ab Who all are three. you? Your pardon, lady. I am but a humble envoy of Lord Abaddon. I seek your majesty's guidance in a very delicate matter. I must firstly plea for your intervention. King Iblis has subjugated a companion of mine, a hybrid much prized by my master. A transgression which could prove dangerous to all of us. It is also my grave duty, I feel, to speak boldly, to warn you that your husband suspects your majesty of treachery toward him. You are lying. I, think, I just thought she's got bug feet. What the hell's that? But... He was in disguise, keen to test our loyalties, said he could reach the ear of the queen if we... Oh, that. No, of course he suspects me. He is right to. Leaving his impregnable hall of gods to hunt for plotters. It's his favorite pastime. Well, it is also true that he has recklessly captured a hybrid. Doubtless he has. Advice now. While in Volca, you should aspire to emulate the strength of the Jinn, and not our talent for deceit. Why do you lie? Your Majesty? You are no envoy of Abaddon. We have played host to Abaddon's henchmen and thugs countless times. You are not one of them. I oh, she got you there, Scree. He's uh, trying a new type of uh, henchman these days. <laughs> I have the gift of reading people. I love this game. Their inner thoughts. Be aware of that. Who do you serve? Abaddon. You are stubborn at least. Courageous even. And there is something deeper within you that I confess I cannot read. But I shall in time. As for the simpler matter, you serve Arella. If you have come to seek my help, you be wise not to anger me and be plain. What is it you want? I need to rescue uh, this hybrid girl from your husband. That is what you want now. Why did you come to Volca? I have come from the Nexus with the last hope of saving us all. Our guardian, Kronos, has been murdered. The Timekeeper is dead? His heart cut out. The work of a hybrid, the orders of Abaddon. The Nexus has fallen to chaos already. It is only a matter of time before all the realms topple, Volca included. For years I warned Iblis that Abaddon could not be trusted. But he has always been blinded by the Dark One's gift of immortality and a pledge of influence beyond this realm. Now his greed may cost us everything. He may have been warned of your coming by Abaddon. Intercepted this hybrid for fear of her threat to him. Iblis always likes to strike first. If you can help us, your majesty, you must. If our dynasty is teetering on a precipice, allow me to decide what I must do. Where is your hybrid now? Still with the king, I imagine. His jinn essence has melded her will to his own. Yeah, Hold Jen, out your yeah, terrible stuff. Unlike the essence from Whiskey. Iblis, mine Better. will not consume her mind. Ah. If you elect not to trust me, that is your choice. Well, don't really have a choice, do I? Now, rescue your hybrid from Iblis's power and return to me. With her, we will stand a chance. If you fail, then we may as well all join the ancient kings and the legendary corpse of Abdesir in the labyrinth beneath Volca. Oblivion would soon be no more. Yeah, Thank but Skyrim would still be around. I mean... Okay, can't go that way. Came in that way, so. Yeah. 
Yeah, I've, yeah, I'm guessing, yeah, this way, because we came in that way. We're back here, or is this a different area? Oh, yeah, this is the arena. Ah, thankfully all the bodies are still there, so we can still drain their essence. No. No. Oh, I'm full. Okay. Okay, boss fight time. Uh... Jen? You. Hey, I'm glad you're still alive. This way I get to kill you myself. Wait! It's me, Scree! We're allies! We're friends even, remember? I don't think so. You must remember me! We came here together! Why in hell would I come in here? You're not well, Jen. The Jin essence passed you by Iblis has placed you in his thrall. Well, I have felt kind of trippy lately. See? You're not yourself at the moment. Let me help you, please. You don't really want to hurt me. You would help a lot more if you stay still. Jen, you're making a mistake. Uh, okay, I wish I could My do that. Short stack. Please, please don't call me that. Ooh, you don't like short stack, huh? What's the problem, half pint? <laughs> Suddenly you're some kind of bonsai badass, huh? Well, come on then, Pee-wee. Step up. Right, young lady. You leave me no option. Yeah. Bring it on. Yeah, I think Jen's supposed to have the Jen blades there. Oh, excuse me. Uh. Yeah, obviously I'm supposed to possess something in this room. Alright, Jen. Don't give you an ass kicking. 
Let's break Iblis's hold over you. Jen, how are you feeling? Ugh. Like I just stepped out of the mosh pit. I assume that's not good. What happened back there? Man, I was having some weird dreams. The essence Iblis passed to you made you his pawn. I lost control. Did I do anything bad? Well, yes, but no more than I'd expect under the circumstances. What was I doing? Freaking out? Talking to tongues? Channeling Elvis? It doesn't matter, Jen. You're back now and that's all that counts. Come on, Scree. I won't be embarrassed. Was I like some drooling wreck slumped in the corner? Because I have done that a few times on a night out. Oh. Oh my god. I'm remembering. I hate you. Well, we hit each other. It was six of one, half a dozen of the other. I called your names. Scree, I am so sorry. It's in the past now, Jen. No, really, Scree. Your size is simply... <laughs> it, it, it's not an issue for me. Just drop it, will you? Okay. Got some vad be arkar kwa khur. Jen should have sent you to the bed. Look, better <laughs> shift into the jinn aspect to check Malakel's essence is pure. Let's see. Must kill Shorty. Oh, very funny. <laughs> Scree, wait up. I was teasing. You know you're a giant in my eyes. Oh, don't be so sensitive. Oh, that's sad. I love the writing in this game. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll call it a video here. Uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.